to get the get this edit off the computer we've rolled into summer squeezed in one more day on the hill after my season edit of course I didn't think I'd get anything today to really add to the edit fun fact I built this I was on the crew that built this chairlift there when Doppelmeyer came up that was kind of fun and then also the next year that giant green building right there the house is all it's the chair barn uh, yeah construction is fun I've been racing to finish this duplex, so it's been tough trying to edit this stuff. Ooh. So we got some spring schmoo, fast schmoo, and I'm back on the K2 Kreitlers. I had skied these once this winter, night skiing, and I really liked them the one day I skied them, but then I took the bindings off and ran through a bunch of different skis, and finally I was like, I gotta get back on these things. And they're pretty awesome. They're long, they're like 200. But they just, they carve when you want them to and they break loose when you want them to. But you don't really feel like you need to break them loose. They just kind of rail, they railroad, but in a comfortable fashion. This left footer, then right, this next left foot turn here was real enjoyable for some reason. On tape, it's not so, it's like, wah, they just sank into the turn and. It's funny, I remembered it as a turn, and then I came and watched it. I was like, oh, that doesn't seem that cool, but the skis just really sat in there. So who in the world would put a mogul line on our mountain? See that bump line that wasn't there all year? It almost destroyed me as I came in hot across the top. Didn't even know it was there, as I've done this line a million times in the winter, and there's not a bump line. <laughs> Good uh, triple smash. I actually almost biffed it. These den bindings, I think I was on 12 and they stayed on. Like, oh my god. But it's just so cool as the mountain melts, all this terrain pops back out. So you don't quite know what you're going to get. There's all sorts of little glide cracks and stuff poking around now. Remember in the winter, back on this thing, it was just pure pow. These things was hold a straight line. I was on those Igneuses the other day, and they were pretty darn good. So this run was a new run. There's a new variation. See that first blip to the second blip? I decided to basically bomb it as hard as I could from the first roll, and then dive across the top of the second roll at maximum velocity. fun and it's not to say I've never I've skied in the area obviously but to actually link those two rolls together in that way that was the first which is great 30 years later finally found that line I don't know I'm gonna call it something that'll be a go-to favorite next winter then I tried to bomb in from that roll hard off of trap line as fast as I could kind of like petered out the speed it wasn't as awesome as I thought it would be but the ski season was as awesome as I could have hoped and this is the official last run of the day. Thanks for watching. See you next year.